So yes, Red Dead Redemption has released on the PS5, the PS4 Pro, and the PS4, but this one is actually a bit more exciting. The Switch, Nintendo, or Nintendo in general, has never had Red Dead Redemption available until today. Um, it's forty pounds or fifty US dollars again. How does it match to the obviously the PS4 version, and how does it match to the original version? And the fact we can now play Red Dead in a portable console on a portable console is pretty is a pretty big deal a very big deal so um let's check it out let's see how it holds up obviously playing with the console docked so hopefully it's 1080p fingers crossed and uh let's see what happens I can tell instantly it's not quite got the sharpness of the PS4 version on that ship. It's just the anti-aliasing wasn't quite quite there. I'll look at the settings in a minute though. Yeah, this is such a small console, isn't it? It's quite an old console now actually as well, the Switch. I'm grateful, Mrs. Bush, that they are finally bringing civilization to this savage land. I could not agree with you more, my dear. My daddy settled this land, and I know he'll be looking down on us, pleased at how we help the natives. Yes, they've lost their land, but they've gained access to heaven. Father, do you mean unless an innocent receives communion, they're destined to go to hell? Uh, that hardly seems fair. Uh, what I mean to say, Jenny, is that there is a great deal of difference between an innocent and a savage. I never thought of it that way. Yes, they live like animals, but they're happier now. Oh. Not only do people now have motor cars, Father, but I heard that pretty soon, we will be able to fly. No, only angels can fly, Jenny. No, no, apparently people can fly. Didn't you hear? Out in Kansas, a man even got a car to fly. <laughs> <laughs> I hardly think so, Jenny. Apparently, Mr. Johns wants to run for governor which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. 
Nate Johns. Yes. His family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. I don't want to be judgmental, but this state should not be ruled by such a disgusting family. A family without class. Apparently. The John's family have made a lot of money, and he has a lot of friends in politics. Mrs. Bush, money isn't everything. There are many things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. What you must remember, my dear, is that we have been brought here to spread the word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the gifts. It is the opportunity we have, the chance to live among people who are decent and who do not kill each other. And who let you worship in peace. Uh, it, it's so confusing, Father. Sometimes I find it impossible to make the distinction between a loving act and a hateful one. I mean, they often seem to be the same thing. Yes, Jenny, it, it is confusing. But you only have to ask me if you need help. Indeed. Well, here we are, Mrs. Bush. <gasps> Armadillo. Our first few steps into playing Red Dead on a Nintendo console, kind of mad. Actually looks not too bad. Doesn't quite again match the quality of the PS4 version, but I don't think it's too bad. It's not too bad. Oh yeah, quickly options um, before we continue. Right, options, oh, okay, oops. It always takes me a while to get used to the, the, the button layout. <laughs> always. Uh, so let's turn the subtitles on. Boop. Here we go. So in terms of anti aliasing there's not the same options as the PS4. As far as I can tell. Hmm. I can't remember where it was. Was it here earlier? Yeah, it's not here at all. Interesting. I wonder why that is. I don't feel too good. Hmm. Anyway. John Marston. Mr. Marston! Mr. Marston, over here! Seems a bit busy, doesn't he? You must be John Marston. Sometimes. I'm Jake. Your friends from Blackwater hired me to guide you. They ain't my friends, but pleased to meet you, Jake. I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. Yeah, I'm going to Germany next week, and I'm really tempted to take my Switch with me and just play this. Very, well, very right, tempted. Let's up and hit the trail. Right, do it. Mount up. Easy on the spurs now. We don't need to draw undue attention. Yeah. Whoa. See. John Marston. you want to visit? That's right. Ain't taking nobody up to the fort in a long time. Strange place for a decent fella to want to visit, if you don't mind me saying. Who said I was a decent fella? It's been abandoned for years now. Folks say it was built during the Mexican War. What kinds of soldiers around back then? Why'd they leave? Well, I ain't entirely sure. I heard they had to go up north to fight Indians or... Maybe they got tired of being soldiers and went looking for gold. You know how things is. So what are you doing up at the fort? I'm looking for an old friend. Well, like I says, 
You ain't gonna find many folk around those parts these days. Those you do find are about as sociable as an ulcerated back too. <laughs> I mean, I ain't one to judge a man by the company he keeps, but... Well, he ain't been friends for a long time. Oh, bit of pop in there. This definitely feels closer to the, the sort of PS3, uh, Xbox 360 version. A little bit. Well, again, that's to be expected, I guess. Time in Armadillo, Mr. Marston? I doubt it. I ain't planning on staying very long. Well, if you're fixing for some female company, you can do a lot worse than Armadillo. Fine as cream gravy they are. Not like Thieves Landon. Dang, those girls ain't even fit for a drinking man to hold up with. I'm a married man, I'm afraid. Ain't we all? <laughs> if your boy finds out, she'll slap you good. <laughs> good and proper. You know it. Deal. Yeah, so it was the marshal who hired me. Lee Johnson, do you know him? I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from some Blackwater big bugs asking for a guide. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. You ain't very talkative, are you? No. Nope. I'm just chewing the dog, mister. That's how I am. I don't mean nothing by it. Trust me. There's things you're better off not knowing. I'm a dangerous man. Very Damn dangerous. Coyotes. What a waste of good meat. Almost there, Mr. Marson. Just over this hill. Yeah. Easy. Yeah. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rode in and took the place over. So I understand. This is where we park ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. <laughs> I wish maybe they did a bit of work to his face. <laughs> Is that a bit cruel? Just needs a bit of work. Bill! Where are you, Bill? Come here, Bill. Sorry, getting far too into this again. Bill! Bill, I've come for you! Bill Williamson! Come out here right now! Go away now, John! Don't make me kill you. Nobody needs to kill anyone, Bill. You must think I was born yesterday. You always did think I was an idiot. That ain't fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> oh. Do I look like I need saving? Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. Well, you never tried to save me before. You only seemed to save yourself. Bill, I implore you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> you implore me. You always were one for fancy words. <laughs> oh. Well, things are different now, John. Now I'm in charge! No more Dutch! And no more you! <sighs> implores. I, I implores you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Well... Oh. <laughs> Poor guy. I'm almost surprised it didn't come out and finish him off. Open the door. Bam! Double tap. He dead. John gone. Oh, 
was born in McFarlane. Why does she instantly look like a bunny as well? She looks like a bunny McFarlane. She just does. It's a perfect name. Load? Oh, <laughs> don't worry. Load him is quite quick. Well, you're alive. So it would seem. So, how do you feel? I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was. Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us $15. I'm sorry, madam. Should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To die, Mr. Er, Mr. Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarland. Miss Bonnie McFarland. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarlane. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? I was trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? Dumb. Just like you. Thank you, Miss. <laughs> See my hat? I have. And, uh, what will you do now? Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic, just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. And thank you. For saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. I'll bear that in mind. What is that weird, like, screensaver mode that comes up? <laughs> what is that on the Nintendo Switch? Why would I want the screen to go black for? I didn't realize. I'm going mad. I'm sure, it's saying you can turn off. So yeah, definitely not quite the same graphical fidelity as the PS4, PS5, PS4, PS4, you know. All those PlayStation consoles, but still. And considering the, the shadows definitely look better, I think. Actually, no, again, not quite a shot. I'll take that back. Alright, Bonnie McFarlane. Do you need some help? Mr. Marston, back in the land of the living, I see. I am. I it's about time I started paying back that fifteen dollars. Well, no time to waste. The horses are saddled up over here. Yeah, the PlayStation version had like was it anti-aliasing FFX? I think it was, and FSR. And for some reason, they're not available the on this office. platform. It's also where we lock up good for some for reason. Outlaws such as yourself. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. That's fair. Yep. Hop on up. He won't bite. Oops. Yeah! <laughs> I love the Nintendo controller. So you can get your bearings. Uh, well, going for a nice little tour. Have a little look around. Woohoo! It's a very nice, nice, gentle pace. To your right is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Hello there! Hello! Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. Very impressive indeed. And here's the corral. This one's for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. 
suspect you've stolen more horses than you've broken. Now, where'd you get such an idea? First impressions are hard to erase. Hmm. I get that. I get that. <laughs> Is it fair? That's the train station. Things sure have changed since the line finally got finished. Bringing in all sorts of new folk like yourself. Is that such a bad thing? Change is only good when it makes things better. I love the soundtrack for this game as well. It's one of my favourite games of all time. I wish maybe it was treated a little bit better this recent port, but... That's the barn over there. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. At least the game's playable now on the Nintendo Switch. And PlayStation 4. I guess that's And here plus. we are, back at the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarlane. Miss McFarlane. Hello, mister. Yeah, I pressed the wrong button. Damn it. I pressed Y. I pressed y. There we go. Come on, this is the only chance you're going to get to rest. Well, I will rest then. Let's go. How about a cold drink, Mr. Marston? Thank you, ma'am. Getting shot, then riding a horse seems to take it out of you. <laughs> I could use a rest. Sure. Come on in. I'll show you the house, and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Mr. Marston. Miss McFarland. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just who is trespassing on our land. This is a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. It's a mighty fine weapon you got there. We'd best Pulling off the barrel. Moving. This is a dangerous time of night for us. I'm sure it is. Let's hitch up. In case you guys um, want to watch more Red Dead, by the way, um, I've uploaded, up uploaded the PS4 version of this port. Thank you, Mr. Marston. Oop. I feel a lot happier someone's along with me. No problem. I feel a lot happier now I got a rifle. Well, with your trigger itch and my feminine intuition, we should make quite a team. Yeah, the full game, I believe, is up on my channel already. But I played on Xbox originally. Um... And Red Dead Redemption 2, of course, which is one of my, again, one of my favorite games of all time. Look, those damn rabbits are at the crops again. Get yeah, down and give me a hand, will you? Yep. Be all right. Easy now. Come on. Ooh, interesting vibrations on the controller. That wasn't either, was it, Bonnie? Goodbye, rabbits. In my sweet call. Oh, I'm not quite done yet. We should keep moving. There's still a ways to go. Is that a target? Who's the target? Come on, boy! <sighs> if it's not the rustlers stealing our cattle, it's the rabbits stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city, become a lady of leisure. Oh. Before they scare the livestock. Quick, we're going after the chickens. Damn, this horse is quick. Gee! Come on. A bit dead on it. That one's shot already. Yeah. That's it. Damn coyotes. God damn. Yep, yeah, I'll see him. Shoot him. Why can't you shoot him? What's that about? It's willing to fire. There we go. One more left. It's got a chicken, damn it. Ooh! Don't mess with John Master. Come on! 
Yeah, Dead Eye gets very, very good towards the end of the game. It's, some would say, maybe OP, but... You know, you can actually handle a rifle. It's something I've had a little experience in. Maybe Bill Williamson did get lucky after all. Luck didn't yeah. really come into it, miss. You're a useful man to have around the ranch, that's for sure. But don't think I've forgotten what brought you here. We'll do whatever we can to help you. I sure appreciate that, Miss McFarland. This is you, Mr. Marston. I wonder if the wife will be getting jealous at this point. <laughs> Probably. Thank you stay you there, help, Mr. Marston. Makes me kind of happy I saved your life. Get some sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Miss McFarland. Good night. Yeah, so that was the uh, the Switch version of the game. Hope you guys got a good impression of how it looks, how it feels. Um, again, pretty cool that this game is now on a Nintendo console, finally. Still not on PC, which is kind of mad, isn't it? Let's be honest. <laughs> Actually ridiculous. Unbelievable, some would say. Um, yeah, I really don't know why they didn't release it on PC as well. I can't imagine it would take that much effort. Is PC probably the easiest platform to develop for if you've already got like the base game ready to go? I don't know. Kind of weird. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, this this video. Um, yeah, see you guys soon. Bye-bye.